Uh, my name is Dave Tushler. I'm with Brightview Tree Company. Um, I am the director of horticulture, and one of the one of the things I do for my work is I grow small trees. And people often ask, why are roots important? Well, roots are important because they have four vital functions to the health and vigor of a tree or a, any plant for that matter. Um, they absorb, so the root tips and the root tips only absorb water and minerals from the surrounding soil. Those roots also conduct uh, water and minerals up into the leaves and up into the trunk of the tree to feed the leaves. Um, they, they provide storage. So those big roots are actually carbohydrates stored for use when the tree isn't actively growing or isn't actively in leaf and collecting sunlight and making carbohydrates. And also one of the most critical roles roots play is anchorage. And a group, good root system, a good healthy, well-developed root system will anchor a tree for many years. A seed's first job is to produce a taproot which goes down looking for water, it's also the initial support for the tree. But as a tree matures, it will focus more on producing lateral roots or roots out to the side. These roots are absorbing roots and they're looking for minerals, breaking down organic matter that help feed the tree. As an example, here you see a perfect root system. This is a Podocarpus gracilia or African fern pine. And you'll note that there's a tap root which came from the seed. This tree's about six months old. Tap root came down and followed down through the middle of the container, and now it started forming lateral roots or absorbing roots that will help stabilize and hold the tree up. I like to say roots are lazy, but they'll always take the path of least resistance. If there's water 100 feet that way or water 10 feet that way, they will go get the water that's 10 feet away. They will not grow through a rock. They'll grow through the soft, fluffy dirt that you just dug up over here. Um, one of the reasons that you see sidewalks lifted is there's a huge water source in that lawn underneath the sidewalk. So again, why grow 100 feet each way down the parkway when three feet under the sidewalk, there's a giant lawn, nice and moist, full of lots of nutrients from lawn fertilizer and water from keeping that lawn green. Roots are just as important as the top of the tree. The top of the tree is the aesthetic part that we see. And we've done a lot of work in studying on making sure that the tops of trees are secure and safe for people to live under. But what we often forget is 50% of that tree is underground and in the form of roots. And they're just as important for the health and longevity of a tree. We should always think, how can I improve the health of my root system if I want to improve the health of my tree?